you are describing the Grinch. Greenway is going to fire us all if we don't come up with something good. Do you understand that? Are you kidding? Christopher Smith was the greatest writer of Christmas stories who ever lived. Mr. Hobbs, I met this guy who recently acquired a desk once owned by Christopher Smith, and in his secret drawer, he finds a manuscript. A lost Christmas, <coughs> Christmas story? A lost Christmas, Christmas story. Be careful, it's the only copy. I'm in love, and I don't care who knows it! Buddy, please, we're very busy. Dad, I need a table for two at Tavern on the Green at 7 p.m. Uh, Christmas Eve. Oh, and $400. The guy's waiting in the lobby, Mr. Hobbs. Buddy, just give me a minute. Do me a favor. Sit there in that chair. Amuse yourself. Okay, Dad. Well, bring that guy up here. I want to thank him personally. He's not waiting for a thank you. He's waiting for three hundred thousand dollars. What? Mr. Hobbs, we've been trying to find a uh, uh, Christmas a uh, uh, Christmas story, but we found nothing. We're idiots. Here comes a lot from God. And God gets mad when you don't accept his gifts. Fine, I'll write this guy a check. Greenway will understand, right? In fact, she'll be thrilled. There'll be Christmas bonus or says for everyone. I mean, this is going to make us millions. That was the only copy. What? I cannot deal with this anymore. Just go back to the apartment, get your things, and leave. For where? I don't care. I don't care where you go. I don't care that you're an elf. I don't even care that you're my son. Just get out of my life forever. 